Okay, I wanted to do a quick walkthrough of the cockpit area as well as the interior. This is the 48 inch deep swim platform from swimplatforms.com. As you can see, it is huge. We have the platform mounted storage box, which is where we keep the dock lines. There are six dock lines included. The magma grill and case and the post. The post mounts right there so you can do all your cooking right here on the platform. Come up here onto the cockpit area. We have the woven vinyl flooring cockpit table, U-shaped seating. We do have the pad that goes in the center there to form a big sun pad. Coming up here to the helm, we've got the Cobra 25 watt VHF radio with built-in GPS for distress. We have a gauge that shows the battery. It's also a USB charger as well as a 12 volt charger. We got the Humminbird 947C chart plotter, Hawkeye depth gauge, there's a bolster buddy bolster seat which gives you two additional positions to sit up higher. Underneath the seat is where we keep the life vests as well as the safety slash emergency kit. Coming into the inside you see we have all new cabinets, all new carpeting, new fridge, new countertop, new upholstery, new table, new door. It's been completely redone. All the light bulbs are now LED. Come in here we have a pressure water system. We have the gas, well, I'm sorry, alcohol stove. 12 volt fridge also runs on 110. Storage on this side, as well as this side. Inside there. There's a 19 inch flat screen TV. Storage underneath both seats. There's storage in there. I don't know if you can see it very well with the lighting. Over here on this side, we also have the bag that has the camper canvas in there. That is all brand new this year as well. It's also where the bracket sets for the table. We have the cushion that's been redone to set here. So this forms an entire berth when it's down. And here's the head. It does have a pump out head, which is nice. You don't have to empty it. The table goes on that wall there when it's not in use. In here is the mid cabin. This is what we use. We've got the extra port window there. Come around here. My wife and I fit fine in here. We're not very big, but we fit fine. Uh, not sure what else to show you on the inside. Let me try getting back here. See if I can give you a view from this area here. You can see, like I said, everything is all brand new. We did add an additional fire extinguisher inside and a carbon monoxide detector. The only part of the upholstery that wasn't redone was the band in the back of the mid cabin. Everything else has been completely redone. And that should about cover it. I think you get a pretty good idea of the condition that it's in here. We do have the hatch with the screen as well for ventilation. And I'll try and get a video of opening up the engine hatch and show you that area tomorrow.